evil spirit. No wonder why he hates onions. <laughs> Where's those onions? I need to make Roddy go away. Woo! If I brought onions into the house, would that make you go away? I just want to know, would you like some onions? There is onions! Oh, screw this. Good morning! Please, afternoon. Good afternoon! Minions, how's everybody doing today? We are headed out. We'll get some Zycam because Ronnie and I are feeling a little bit on the sick side. We feel a cold coming on, so I'm going to go get that. It is Tuesday. I'm going to go get these puppies done. I'm going to change it to yellow. Fun for summer. Hey, it's joke time. It's joke time, Kaden. Hey, I like your shirt, by the way. Thanks. Finn Bella. Okay, but first, did you know that the Egyptians believe that onions keep away evil spirits? <gasps> Oh, that's why Ronnie has a reaction. He's an evil spirit. No wonder why he hates onions. <laughs> I love onions, and I keep them around the house, and he hates them, so I guess that's a good way to keep Ronnie Is that away. A vampire? Vampire? Yep. Vampire? Vampires? Like, no, that's garlic for vampires, not right. onions. No, Daddy's not a vampire. Apparently, he's an evil spirit because I keep him away with my onions. <laughs> What's your joke, buddy? What did the female mushroom say about the male mushroom? Dude, first it's onions, now we're mushrooms. Now I'm hungry for onions and mushrooms. What did the female mushroom say to the male mushroom? High five? Get it? High, getting high off the shrooms? Never mind. He's a real fun guy. F fun guy, fun guy! Got it! Oh my gosh, that took me a minute. Oh! That's a good joke, Kaden. Good job. Did I say I love your shirt already? Yes! I like how there is like 15 women in the nail salon and I ask how long the wait and they're like, oh no wait, they always do that. I'm like, yes, there will be a wait. Anyway, we're gonna go get smoothie first. I just give Kaden a huge responsibility. He's still back there at Swirls at the yogurt salon. Salon? <laughs> Is there a thing called a yogurt salon? <laughs> anyway, he's back over here at Swirls. He's gonna bring the drinks over while I come over here. So this is a big responsibility. I'm leaving him in charge of the drinks and coming over here. So let's see how things go. Yay, thank you, buddy. You're welcome. You did good. Okay, Ronnie's gonna come pick up Kaden. He, Ronnie just got done at the gym at the same time I got done with my nails. I went summer yellow, and then my nails are, the, my toenails are the same color, so I went yellow this time. I've never done yellow before, so I, I thought it was different, but I like it. It's kind of fun. Is it color changing? Dainty, oh no, it's not a color changer. Oh, I forgot they have color changing nail polish. I'm gonna have to do that next time, anyway. So Ronnie's gonna come get Kaden and then I'm gonna go to Walmart and get a few things and then go home so and then I have my softball game tonight so that's what today entails. Just drop my keys. So that felt good. I am done with the gym. How are you guys doing today? Somebody's supposed to come meet me and they're not here. I have a real quick question. Quick question. If I brought onions into the house, would that make you go away? Just a, just a simple question, would that make you go away? Well, you know, I could have swore I smelled onions this morning, so you better not have. I may or may not have. You understand the words that are coming out of your own mouth? Listen later, but hear me now. But forever hold your peace. In about a year, I could pull off Shinsuke. Oh, really? I just need, I need it longer. So right now, I can pull off the old Miss, Hi, Ginger. Seamus. And I will definitely be able to do Seamus. But the big question is is that will you go away if I have onions in the house? <laughs> like somebody thinks it's funny. <laughs> do I think it's funny? I think it's funny, you evil spirit.
What in the world is she wearing? She's out here playing softball. Don't stick your butt out at me. coffee before any game because last week I had all this energy after drinking coffee right before a game and today I was just dragging myself I kept I almost hey got another strikeout I got one strikeout that normally doesn't happen I usually get walks or at least I hit the ball she had one really really good hit it was sweet but our whole team I mean like all together we did horrible I did horrible but you know you don't you don't always have good days you have bad days and next week is our last game for the season so we're like eh. we're all like meh <laughs> so my baby girl mm, look at oh she's such a sweet girl I don't know no she's she not had, she was outside when i got home oh yeah she was outside the fence when we got home i don't know what you snuck do out. <laughs> you better recognize so i didn't do nothing daddy i didn't see I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Daddy. You I'm better so be. Sorry. Okay, so we got a card from someone. No. This is our P.O. box, from, by the way. From nobody. From nobody. I have no idea who it's from. But I pre-opened the card, so the, the envelope, so I don't have to do it on camera. It's lemons. Uh, ooh. Hey, look, they match my nails. When life gives you lemons. Throw them at people. Throw them at the opposing team. When life gives you lemons. <laughs> Pass gas. What? <laughs> uh, when life gives you lemons. Don't make lemonade. Eat a ding dong. Oh my gosh. No, when life gives you lemons. Make lemon pie. Lemon meringue pie. What do you do? when life gives you lemons. Leave it in the comments below. We want to know what your thoughts are. Because that's fun. Dear Mainvilles, a gift was given to, oh, oh, that's why she got it. Uh, given to Alex's Lemonade Stand Foundation in memory of Elijah, graciously given. Graciously given by, love you, Debs McLeod. She says, a life that touches others goes on forever. And I made this donation on Precious Elijah's birthday in his memory. A couple videos ago, we had asked for people for his birthday to donate to either Connor's Cure or Alex's Lemonade Stand. And so we appreciate, uh, there it is. We appreciate Deb to, uh, donating to Alex's Lemonade Stand and research for childhood cancer. It is very super important to us. 
And um, I want to send out my prayers and hope to Debs McLeod as well as she is going through some health issues. So um, she has been a really great Mainville minion hopeful of ours. She's been a rock on our channel. And so uh, I'm sending out prayers to her. So we, we love you and we appreciate all that you have done for us, Debs. We cannot thank you enough. So thank you. And we're yes. getting all teared up and choked up and emotional over here. Where's those onions? I need to make Roddy go away. Woo! Okay, hold on. I got something I gotta get before we close out. But yeah. okay, I'll be right back. So yeah, please do it for us. Show Debs some love. Uh, we have such a great family, and, and we appreciate you guys so much, especially when life gives you lemons. I love to go on YouTube and read some comments. It really, really helps me out. Um, so, hey, we're going to get ready to close out this video. and I just want to know, would you like some onions? There is onions. Oh, screw this. What are you doing? Those are not allowed. Oh, I just warded off an evil spirit, guys, with an onion. Ha ha ha! Oh, yeah. I want to say hello to all the new subscribers. Thank you so much for subscribing. If you had just came into this vlog, Ronnie absolutely despises onions. He thinks they should go to hell. He can't t touch, smell, or taste them. Uh, so I just thought it was kind of funny to make that joke on him today. So if you're new, that's what's going on with Ronnie. He hates onions with a passion. He'll have to tell you a story about onions one day. Hello, thank you for subscribing. You are now part of the Mainville Hopefuls here on YouTube. And as Ronnie would say, hello, hello, hello. To all the new subscribers, if you are new, leave it in the comments below. Let us know you're new so we can comment and say hi to you. Don't forget to favorite and share. We'll see you guys all for another vlog. Love ya, those onions are amazing.